Right, guys, I don't think these geese like me. Hey folks, Repic here. So I just signed up for a duathlon. What am I thinking? I'll explain in this video. Let's go for a ride. But before we go, just a friendly reminder to hit that subscribe button. I really appreciate it. If you want to keep up to date with all the videos that I'll be posting about my journey up to the duathlon, hit that subscribe button. And thank you very much. Let's go for a ride. All right, folks. Uh, first off, just want to thank you for joining me on this ride. And uh, yeah, I think the first question that many people are probably going to ask is, why not do a triathlon? You know, if you're going to do one of those multi-sport things, why not do a triathlon? But um, yeah, quite simply, I can't swim. So yeah, that's out of the question. About to hop onto the Copper City Pass here. All right, so the other thing I got to mention is uh, technically I'm not really doing a full duathlon. It's going to be a sprint duathlon. So uh, the event is called Do Ridgefield, and it's going to be in Ridgefield, Connecticut, and it's two months from now, June 6th. Uh, so it's April 1st right now. So I've got two months to really kind of prep. Um, but the event is, uh, what a sprint duathlon is, uh, it's going to be like two and a half mile running and then it's going to be a 13 mile bike ride and then followed up with a, uh, I believe it's a 3.1, like a 5k run. So, um, so yeah, there's that. And, uh, yeah, the reason I, uh, I did the sprint duathlon was because I've never done a duathlon before. I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, yeah. So my, uh, my number one reason for uh, signing up for this duathlon was um, just to say that, uh, that, you know, I was able to do one. Um, it's just kind of neat to, to say like, hey, I was able to do something. It's a sense of accomplishment to, do, to be able to do something that you've never done before. So, uh, so there's that. So I chose to do a sprint duathlon versus the, the whole duathlon because um, I know I could cycle like the distance of the full duathlon, but um, the thing is the running. I haven't been running, so... Um, yeah, so the running with the, with the full duathlon, I think like the first run is like 10K. And you know, the maximum I've ever really run is like a 5K. I've done a lot of 5Ks. So I know I could do that distance. So, so with the sprint duathlon, it's got the 5K run at the end and then it's got like a two and a half mile in the beginning. So like, I know like it's a manageable goal, so. Yeah, guys, I don't think these geese like me. Okay, so let me talk about goals for a second. With anything, you need to set yourself up uh, to accomplish little goals and then work your way up. You can't go from couch to marathon runner, right? You gotta work your way up. Um, so that's one of the reasons I'm doing the sprint duathlon, to get my feet wet, to get a little bit comfortable with what uh, happens during the duathlon. I've never done one, so there's the transitions, you know, moving from your bike shoes to the uh, running shoes. So I have no idea what to expect. Um, so yeah, little goals and uh, work your way up. Okay, so for training, I'm not really gonna be doing anything special for training. I'm just gonna be riding my bike like I normally do. I'm not worried about the running. And here's the thing, you gotta know your weaknesses. My weakness with this is running. I used to run, uh, my knee got a little bit, you know, it didn't feel so great, so I stopped running. I've only recently gotten back into running, so I know my weakness is running. So, I mean, I'm not really gonna be doing any specific training, but I will be running a little bit more just to make sure that I'm comfortable running the distance. And like I said, I know I could do the 5K, I know I could do the two and a half, I just gotta do, you know, them separately, and I think I'll be fine. Um, so yeah, for trading, nothing really crazy. Just gonna be running a little bit more than I have in the past.
that's going to do it for the video guys thank you for watching hit the subscribe button i'm going to be posting some more videos about this uh, duathlon journey so i'll keep you posted thank you very much for watching rep it out